Hey everybody, I'm actually unreading the unsealed files from the United States of Court of Appeals uh, featuring Jelaine Maxwell and uh, versus uh, Julie Brown, the Miami Herald Media Company who filed to have these unsealed uh, for view. And to make a long story short, I did a search uh, here uh, for Clinton, as in Bill Clinton, and the name comes up 48 times, but when you go through it uh, to highlight it uh, in detail and find out what's going on, uh, you find such things as, okay, the only reference that one could make a mistake on is, is attached as Exhibit B as a true and correct copy of an article, a uh, teenage girl recruited by pedophile Jeffrey Epstein reveals how she twice met Bill Clinton. And that's as far as anything that would implicate Clinton, it says, for example, that uh, she went to Mr. Epstein, Mr. Maxwell, went to pick up Bill Clinton, a huge black helicopter, and her conversation with Mr. Clinton was about Ms. Maxwell's pilot skills. Donald Trump was a good friend. Donald Trump was a good friend of Mr. Epstein and flirted with her. Um... Plaintiff's admission of the falsity of her original allegations are fatal to her defamation claim as to the second sentence. Um, it goes on, it's getting off the track here as far as Clinton's concerned. Uh, then, of course, when you click through, there's still, these are the notes referring to uh, the Daily Mail article um, talking about trips with Bill Clinton. But there's nothing here that for example, it says, in this case, President Clinton was on the island where I was present. Absolutely 1,000%. That is a fabrication of a total lie. And that's, um, it says, Virginia is absolutely totally lying. And this is from, uh, I believe, Dershowitz. You did fly on planes, Jeffrey Epstein's planes, with President Clinton. Is that correct? It says, I've flown, yes. Uh, and so uh, there's no... There's nothing here that nails Clinton in any way about her doing anything other than being associated with somebody who has a life that Clinton doesn't seem to know about. He says, would it be fair to say that they're friends? I wouldn't be able to characterize. Um, he says, when you were on the plane with Jeffrey and President Clinton, uh, um, and uh, this and then it goes on to say, let's see here. Ah. Was that your first time meeting Bill Clinton? And this had to do with the Secret Service. Uh, and um, said that they didn't know their names. This was the uh, David Rogers file. And, uh, and um, it goes on from there. If we just simply scale through here. There are many times have you seen any pictures prior to that time of Bill Clinton in any of Jeffrey Epstein's planes or homes? Now I'm not aware of him. Uh, there's a lot of I'm nots. I don't know. Uh, let's see here. Oh, wait back up. A picture of Bill Clinton in the plane. Do you mean the picture is on the wall in the plane or a picture taken of Bill Clinton on the plane? A picture Bill Clinton on the wall of his airplane. On the wall. So I have a picture of me and actually the crew with Bill Clinton on the plane, but it's not on the wall of the plane. Um, and so then there's what was the picture of you and Bill Clinton taken? This was, I think it was the first flight. The flight we just yes yes to the best of your knowledge is that the first time that bill clinton flew with jeffrey epstein to the best of my knowledge it was the first time that we have flown him okay on flight number 72 which is page 54 okay and is there any way of knowing where bill when the one got to saint thomas okay and so then it goes on it says um, here, talks about 
Bill Clinton, Doug Ban, three service agents, a Jeffrey Epstein, Jelaine Maxwell, Sarah Kellen. It says, do you know what those passengers stayed in London? All right. Um, Doug was Bill Clinton's attorney, right hand guy. Says, want to know who Doug Ban was. And and they talked about going to Paris, picking up Bill Clinton. It looked like Bill was using them for a lot of trips over long distances. Um, and let's see, they said, uh, well, and there's a lot of this again. Epstein, Maxwell, Kellen, Clinton, Mike, Doug, Brand, Janice, and Jessica. Okay. So they were Secret Service. And you picked up Clinton and six passengers. Doug Bland and there's a lot of circumstantial evidence. Like he slept at a hotel, there's a lot of guests, I guess, at a hotel. Did you leave President Clinton and Doug Band? It's possible. Not found, sorry. There's a lot of that. And then if that says Sri Lanka, then yes, we probably did leave Clinton in Brunei, I think. And I think we went from there to Bali. We went from Bali without without Bill Clinton, yes. And what was the purpose of the trip to Bali just to get away? And then to Sri Lanka? Fuel stop, okay? Um from there, okay, and then who was on the flight with Bill Clinton? 41, where do you take Bill Clinton? They went to, them to the Azores. And, okay, so in looking at, this is 2,000 pages, but there's nothing here that ties Bill Clinton to anything except using a billionaire's friend's plane to go from one country to another uh, much faster than he would be able to on a commercial airliner. That's what it looks like. And does that mean that Bill had any knowledge of Jeffrey Epstein's behavior? No. But the bottom line is there's nothing here. So on social media... People would say, well, you know, Bill Clinton's been mentioned several times, but you really have to stop and read. And that gets to my next point. People don't read today. It's a good idea to read and look, okay, um, before you start pointing fingers. Just saying.